so Merry Christmas if you're watching this on Christmas. Um, but if not, I'm recording this in Christmas of 2012. So I don't I don't know what that was. Just ignore it. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys all the gifts I got because I wanted to haul this. I got some really good stuff. Got a lot of clothes, which was my main like focus. I asked for a lot of clothes this year, so I'm really excited. And I hope you guys like my haul. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff I got in my stocking. And the first thing I got was this pen plus stylist. Yeah, I don't really need this. <laughs> Um, the next thing I got in my stocking was this Rudolph um, Pez dispenser with some Pez down here. And I thought that was really cute. And then I got my one of my favorite candies ever. I got gummy bears, some Haribo gummy bears. Then I got Nutella. Oh my god, I love Nutella. Oh my god, I love this stuff. So I asked for it for Christmas and I got it. My whole jar to myself because my family hates Nutella. Okay, the next thing I'm going to show you guys are my shoes. So I only got three pairs of shoes, and one of them is not really a shoe, and it's just some slippers. <laughs> and they're like, they have those rigid things on the bottom, um, and you just slip your foot in. It's super soft and comfy, and I always get slippers. It's just a thing. I give my mom slippers every year, and she always gets me slippers, so I, I was expecting it. <laughs> The next thing, um, or pair of shoes I got were these ones from Urban Outfitters, and they are from the Kim Cheek, um, not collection, but, um, designer, um, Kim Chi Blue, and they're just metallic, shiny silver. Okay, the next thing I'm going to show you are my Vans, but I just got plain white ones. And um, I really won't probably wear these till spring, like with some shorts and like my um, elite socks, um, which I also got. I got these for myself, but I had to. Um, I love Nike elite socks. And these are my ones that I bought yesterday. Don't know why I just did that. These are the ones I bought yesterday. And they're just black. So, and I probably wear these like that. I'm not going to show you guys. You guys know what I mean. Um, but I love these. And I just just love these. Okay, so that's all the shoes I got. But it's fine. I don't really need any more shoes. And I have a bunch of gift cards. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you guys is the jewelry that I got. And the first thing I got was this cross um, thing. Um, just put that on, I guess. And it's like that. And I'm pretty sure everybody and their mother owns one of these. Um, the next thing I got was in this. This was just on like a little stand, I think. But these came in little baggies. And I said Urban Outfitters. I'm rambling, sorry guys. Okay, so I saw this on the website and I fell in love with it. It's this gold, um, just kind of, it looks a little bit dented. I'm not really sure what that texture is. If you put that down in the comments, I'd really like to know because I don't really know how to look it up either. Um, but I just love the texture and I love gold jewelry a little bit more than silver jewelry anyway. So, um, I was really happy when I saw that and it's in gold because I originally saw it in silver. So I was really happy that it, my mother got it for me in gold. The next Urban Outfitters thing, or necklace I got, not thing, it's also another triangle. Um, hold on, it's a little bit tangled. Okay. Um, the next thing I got was this necklace, um, and it's like three dimensional, and that's it. And it's just like a triangle. I think it's an isosceles triangle. <laughs> Um, and it's kind of long, as you can see. Um, anyway, so yeah, so this is the necklace I asked for, and I got it. And I just love this. I can see myself wearing that a lot. The next piece of jewelry I got was very interesting. I didn't ask for this at all, um, but my mom happened to see it. And it's this London underground... Oh, sorry, let me just take that off. It's this cuff, and it's the of the London Underground um, metro system and I thought that was so like retro um, and different I'm not really sure what I'm gonna wear it with 
Um, but I'll figure it out. And I thought it was really, really cool. And I love London. We went there about two years ago before Christmas. And I just fell in love with London and Germany. We went all over Europe, but I just fell in love with those two places specifically. So I was really happy when she gave me this cuff. And if you have any ideas what I can wear this with, please tell me because I don't know. Next is this necklace. Um, I currently live in the Midwest, um, which is a big change from where I'm from in California. I'm from Huntington Beach, California originally. So um, I am an OC girl, LA girl, whatever you want to call it. So my mom got me this necklace um, of Los Angeles. And it's by Plastic, and I'm pretty sure you can customize this jewelry too. Um, but I just was really, <clears throat> excuse me, was really happy when I saw this because I miss home so much. All the jewelry I got. Now I'm going to show you guys some of the makeup products. Um, again, I asked for clothes, which you're going to see a little bit later. But um, I didn't really ask for makeup. But I happened to be like seeing these NYX matte. Um, creams all over the place and then my mom got them for me um, seems like my mom's gave me everything but she didn't she just got me a lot um, and so here they are these are the NYX matte soft matte lip creams and um, this one this one is in Antwerp I'm gonna completely butcher these names Addis Abba and then Tokyo um, and I have this middle one, Addis Abia, on my lip. Ooh, focus. And I, ooh, come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. And I actually have Addis Ab <laughs> Addis Abba on my lips right now. I love this color. It's really nice. Uh, next, I'm going to show you what I got from Sigma. I was asked, I actually asked for Sigma brushes. Because um, I want more brushes, but I ended up getting something a little bit better because I wanted this super bad. Um, everybody, again, just like the matte lip creams, we're talking about this. Um, from Clarisonic. I think you guys already know where I'm going with this. Um, but it is this Sigma, um, ooh, what is it called? Cleansing Polishing Tool. And that's what it looks like. And there you go. And I love that it's pink, first of all. Um, and it's like a baby pink. Yeah. So here's the Sigma cleansing and polishing tool. I'm just so excited, you guys, that it's Christmas. Oh, I love Christmas. Everybody's so nice on Christmas. Um, when you got that Sigma cleansing polishing tool. You got this little um, little booklet um, with a brush inside and this is the, what brush is this? This is their eyeliner brush and it's pink and it looks like this. I thought it was a lip brush at first and I was like oh I need that but it ended up being an eyeliner brush so I might use it differently though. And it just says right there and that's what it is and the brush is pretty good um okay that's all for makeup told you it wasn't very long now I'm gonna show you guys the bags I got the first one I got is my new backpack because I was wearing a black tote to school every day then it was just getting you know really hard and stuff so I'm gonna be switching up between these two bags um, with certain outfits the first one I got is this Steve Madden camo bag, and it has highlighter straps, and I just just love this bag. You have no idea. Um, and here it is. And um, I need a backpack, first of all. I have one, Jan Sport, just like plain, um, like an aqua color, but I wanted a cute one. Okay, um, so that's the backpack that I'm going to be switching off with this beautiful thing. This is from... Urban Expressions, and I think I've visited their site a couple of times. Um, this is their little logo. And um, here's the bag. Let me get it nice and... Oh, the camera does not serve it justice. It's actually a really pretty bag. It has um, these braided 
handles right here um, with gold detailing and then it has a strap obviously um, and this is what it looks like and then at the bottom it has that um, it looks a little bit more structured than it is also because there's stuffing inside of it um, but it's definitely real leather and it's a little bit more um, flexible um, it's not as stiff as it looks on camera and it's really cute okay so the moment most of you maybe if you're still here with me have been looking or waiting for or whatever um, the clothes I'm going to show you guys the clothes that I received today so the first clothing I got is this shirt um not my favorite shirt gonna be honest with you wasn't like my or won't be I'm sorry my go-to but um <laughs> I like it I mean it's okay um it has this long you know very nice collar I guess um very thin material and it's a long shirt it's really long um it has a high low hem I'm not really sure if it was like a dress shirt like a literal dress shirt um but it's it's not my favorite shirt but we don't have to tell anybody that um next I got is this t-shirt and it's Cinderella's boxing I believe yeah Cinderella's boxing and this is something I'm probably gonna wear around the house you know maybe to go out to like Wally World or Walmart I call it Wally World sorry um and I mean that was cute I guess um, this is next and last t-shirt I got, thank god. Um, it's this wolf tank top t-shirt material. And I really like this. I like the seam on it. You can't really see it um, unless you're in person, but still I really like it. The only thing I don't like about this shirt is the back. Um, I don't like the gathering. I think it makes it too feminine. And I thought, you know, for an edgy shirt like this um that kind of ruined it just a little bit but not enough for me to just go ahead and give it away um and this is by the rise and fall so yeah so that's that shirt okay now moving on to one of my favorite things i got this whole christmas i've been wanting this forever and i'm just so happy i got it and i know it's gonna be so like okay it's just just a tracksuit um jacket i didn't want the whole actual tracksuit um <laughs> i'm gonna get black pants not the pink pants that go with it um and it's the adidas that's how they say it in german sorry okay and um it has you know the regular and then on the back it has the big adidas sign and i'm just in love with it and then it has a little a little adidas right there it kind of looks like corn but that's okay and um this is what it looks like and it's pink and it's adidas and i just love it and i'm just gonna wear it everywhere i'm gonna wear it to track i'm gonna wear it to everywhere just everywhere okay the next thing i got is something i also fell in love with this is from urban outfitters and it's from pins and needles and it's this sweater it's super light like this will not like Mm -mm. this is not a real sweater this is super thin um and it just has long you know it's just regular sweater um it has a cute zipper in the back there well i don't think i'm really be using that zipper i think it's more for looks because i don't think anybody really needs to squeeze into a sweater um but i love this sweater and i'm gonna wear it like first day of school back from break <laughs> the next sweater i got was this one here's a sweater I love this sweater um I love when guys wear these sweaters because they're so cute but here it is and it has like that long I don't really know how to show this it has like a long oh my god thank you okay thank you and it has like this long um kind of v-neck here um oof this camera does not do most of these clothes justice. I'm very sorry. But here it is. And it goes all the way down. Pockets. Um, I really like it. I know exactly what I'm going to wear it with. Where am I going to wear it? Blah, 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 blah. Okay, the next thing I got was this. <clears throat> excuse me. Was this dress. Love this dress. It's so feminine. It's so pretty. It's just so simple. This, I think, explains my style in a burrito. Like, this is what I 
see myself as. Just, um, here it is. It's really feminine, baby pink. I've already said feminine like five times. Um, one shouldered, and it goes down. It's not really like, it's pleated, but it's not like super pleated or anything. And it's so pretty, and it's like short, and oh, it's just so pretty. I just love this. Just love it. And this is from, in case you want to look, Bar 3. So go look them up. Go search for them because I love that just to death. The next dress isn't my favorite. Um, this kind of reminds me of my fourth grade teacher, something she would wear. I'm definitely going to have to pin it since I'm flatter than an 11-year-old boy. Um, but dress is super pretty um, and it's short. So, but it is got, it's made for a woman with movies, which um, I'm lacking thereof. Um, the next one, also not really my style, but I'm being adventurous and, you know, I'm going to wear it anyway. Um, and it's this dress by Bar 3. Hey! Um, and it's got faux leather right here. And it's really short, and it's got faux leather right there, right next to my face. And it's really, really short. Um, and it's got that in the back, which I'm not a fan of, because um, it like, reminds me of like a bathing suit cover up. This sh dress. The last thing I got this Christmas was this skirt. Um, it's like a pleated skirt all the way around, super pretty. Um, I just love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I talk way too much and I'm so sorry and I keep looking at myself, stop looking at yourself really. Um, anyway, I hope you did really like this video and enjoyed my haul. Um, have a Merry Christmas whatever time of year you are. I hope the next Christmas you have is Merry. And, um, yeah, again, if you want me to do the lookbook, just go ahead and like the video. And, okay, see you guys later. Bye.